I graduate typically about 50 to 60 students every year from my system. And when I look at what's key to their perspective of how it's being built up over time, and I validated this with both the task and Shreya was, some of them were implicit, but some were explicit. They had a balanced four year plan. They were thinking about college or high school as a journey, as an opportunity to explore in the ninth grade, 10th year to figure, 10th grade to figure out their passions. 11th, they zero down on their research on projects that they worked on, like Shreya worked on the Science Gurus and Gurus internship. She had also uh, other things planned with Interact. Tosca did something similar. But in ninth and 10th, they really took the time to figure out their passion. And it wasn't just uh, to debate, let's do model UN, let's do some Taekwondo, let's do some piano. They didn't just throw things all around. Okay. And then came to 12th grade, they got disciplined about what they wanted to go with. So, um, Ninth grade is really about putting a plan together, going into dual enrollments, putting as many clubs. Can everybody on mute, guys? There's somebody who's uh, got something going on behind. So um, go with, uh, you know, summer programs, experimenting with lots of summer programs, uh, at least just applying to many of them. Tenth grade really becomes about saying, fine, I've tried some of these summer programs. I've explored some clubs. I know a little bit about myself. I've done some dual enrollments in community colleges. And tenth grade is really understanding your passion, doing some work on independent research, not research with college professors, but independent research, uh, being part of some competitions, real, zeroing on at least one sport, two clubs, one extracurricular, right? An extracurricular could be something unique or something regular, that's fine. Um, but 11th becomes about research. Uh, how many APs you take, it's not about taking 10 to 12 APs in your three, four years. Uh, I know somebody on this call who went crazy in the 11th grade, uh, trying to manage her APs. I won't take her name. Uh, her name starts with an S. And, uh, yeah, it was really bad. It was really bad. Don't do it. I don't recommend it. Um, I also, it wasn't me, but if it was me, um, I would not recommend it. It was really just not healthy and it the payoff wasn't worth it either. Yeah. So just we'll don't do to, it. We come to some of Tosca's APs that she took by taking SAT, ACT in the 11th grade. Um, having worked with some guided research with under some mentor, could be a PhD student. I mean, I know Shreya does a lot of mentoring for students uh, as her own master's gigs. But uh, learning that and then 12th is, of course, just about putting your stories together, getting your essays down, your recommendations, the time to do all the work happened in the 10th and 11th. 